ladies and gentlemen, a sad day is upon us. However, history is in the making. We have been gathered here tonight to witness for the final time the greatest live show on earth. Please make a warm welcome on the drums from Matthew. Thank you. 
did that. Yeah. This next one is a love song. That's right. They're all love songs. This features my good friend Mark here joins on the flute and the dance maneuver. Damn sure, look, damn it. This is something we're gonna have to get happening tonight because like it's happened once or twice in the career of the land but there's a special dance maneuver that goes with this song. It's the easiest dance move in the world and everybody's gonna be doing it by the end of the song. It's like really when it kicks in at the end but you know that's where it is you know. And it's the easy, like just watch my here. This is all it is. Forward, backward, forward, backward. fingers if you want to, because that's got a kind of a vibe to it as well. Oh, yeah. That's a beautiful thought, funny man. And damn it, the fucking Pope is telling you, y'all.
reason we wrote this song in the first place was because when I was a little kid, me and my three brothers, my two brothers, <laughs> Your sister's a little masculine, but she's not that masculine. Um, Mackie G, brother. yeah, Mackie G's my brother. It's hard to think that because he's quite thin. <laughs> Did I say that? And I'm not the smallest boy. And neither is Bubba Joe over there. Anyway, whenever people came over, we'd get under a blanket. We were about five years old, all of us. The person on the end had their ass hanging out. And we'd crawl into the lounge room singing Chinese dragon in the nude. Dragon in the nude. A fucking Chinese dragon in the nude. A fucking dragon in the nude. Fucking Chinese dragon in the nude.